process stopping the other. Um, they're really talented, and, and Brooks was just amazing. Uh, Wheeler was really tough to guard. Wood hit five out of six threes, but we were somehow able to make some big plays and uh, down the stretch. Miles hit a big three in overtime that gives us a chance. We were able to get a stop when we needed it. This one could have slipped away, I feel like, a few times between Miles, you know, turning it over and not getting stops. What do you think it does about your group that you guys are kind of able to weather that storm? In? I think it's – we're kind of in the same boat at Cal, and uh, so we had that to pull on, draw on, like, hey, you know, can't worry about – got to worry about the result, but I just felt like we had a little more fortitude, a little more we, – we recovered from the – you know, we called the play. We were hoping, hoping to hit Isaac on the ball screen with the kind of stay with Isaac, and Miles just kind of caught in between. But we, like, hey, the game went over. Um, and we got a situation that made one out of two, I think, right? And then we, we had no timeouts, and Miles made a great play, and Isaac made a great finish. So it was good. Did you tell them anything in advance, like, hey, if they miss one, here's what we're doing, or how did that come No, we were, in a, we were in a set with make or miss. We we're thinking you're suing both of them are going to make, and we're going to have to get a three and worry about the foul game. When he missed the second one, I thought Wheeler almost – he could play up tight. I thought maybe and that could happen where he's thinking, I got a foul, but you forget that he missed. But he kind of played off, and then we just went quick there. He dragged pick and roll, and they kind of – in between, and minus hit him, and it was great play. You're down, you're down five with, I think, four minutes. What did you like about that? Obviously, the, the, the last play they said overtime was nice, but yeah, what no, did you like about I, that just like so just just the fact that we blew the coverage. Andre just got wiped out, and Lloyd was wide open in being the three, and it would have been easy to, for us to wilt. Um, and we did like against Colorado, you know, back in December, and uh, just we've been in those we've been in a lot of tight ones on the road and that. So just like the fact we hung in there and gave ourselves a chance, and it would have been easy. We kind of hung our head for a second when Miles got the travel call, or whatever. But uh, it was right back to it. Kyle, I noticed that uh, a lot of the members of the last WC March Madness team were in the locker room. Uh, what was that all about, and what did they have to say? But man, once a Coug, always a Coug, brother. We, we, you're there. We'll welcome you in. We got to, we introduced them to the the ballad of the Palouse that we created here five years ago, and they jumped in. We gave them the little lyrics for it, so we, uh, you know, we celebrate when we win. And it was nice to see those guys. Those guys have a really good rapport with one another. The fact they come here and get together, and then to be able to honor, they, they were really thrilled to, to get that W. How big was Jason? They hit two big end of clock shots, and we went to him in the post. Um, he got in foul trouble in the first half, but he's, he's just got a, he's a steely. He's, I mean, him, I think that group is, and our whole group is, but uh, Miles, and they're, they're not afraid to make some plays. Isaac, awesome. He was telling us that uh, he went to like Donald Watts's like some sort of like shooting facility the other day to get some mid-range shots up. Did yeah. you like have any part of that, or what do you think? No, about that's that? news okay. to me. I heard they came back with their shoes. We got in here a little early, and uh, yeah, Donald has a little club. Uh, I think I say to him whatever shot, fine, worked out, worked out, we did all right, and. Uh, yeah, that's what happened. I, I get maybe I have a little closer look on it. <laughs> Coach, a year ago, uh, it was Bomba in this game here in Seattle. They had 36. This year, five guys in double digits kind of spreading it around. What does it say about this team that you can kind of do it in a different way and you have so many options? Yeah, no, it just uh, – I really thought Isaac was awesome because he had to – they threw a lot of different coverages at him. And even that last play where he tried to – if he gets it on the rim, the game's probably over. But it didn't have no, – there's a couple doubles. But I thought he played really – didn't force it at all. And we just kind of, that's a sign of a good team. Hopefully we've, we've done it on the defensive end with that. Not tonight, but we got to dig in on that. But um, they like each other. They play the right way and uh, gives us a chance to win.